Welcome back, race fans. It's time for the ORL Division 2 race number 5. This one's on Mad World MX 20 laps. This is Dark Star commentating, and with me in the booth today is my good friend and fellow driver, Mr. Stylizing. What Say is hello, brother. What is up, guys? This is Mr. Stylizing here, as you can tell, and I'm ready to start this race. Heck yeah, it's going to be a heck of a race. The start on this is going to be amazing. Um, that's me in the white there. You can watch me time this gate perfectly and jump right ahead. Watch it. Zoom. There I go. That is right real up nice the driving. Range. Well, thank you, Stylizing. In either co what that looks like Dark Star out in second, and over the burn goes Monster. He's out of it. Yeah. He's yeah, in the back he, now. Uh, yeah, he actually manages to recover pretty quickly. He's a solid driver. He knows he knows this track as well as anybody. He's going out in first, yeah. that looks like gold gold liner. And uh, that was Gold Liner 40 laps. Now watch this lag here. Right when I get in front of Gold Liner, bang! Everyone lags back in front of me. I was mad the entire race because of that, but I kept driving. You gotta, you gotta suck it up, man. It's Xbox Live. So it looks like you've fallen back to fifth, and yeah, which looks like KSI Milkman now out in second, and now you've come back to third as one of the races have fallen off the edge. Reached. You get a good look here. That's Gold Liner 40 line, uh, Niner in first, followed by Bowie Boy, then myself, Dark Star. And then, then we got KSI Milkman. Go ahead. KSI, Street Killer, and out in back we have Monster. Which he's coming around the corner <laughs> now. Now that's what? And there goes Street Killer crashing hard, leaving Monster to now take fourth place. Monster's a solid driver. He's my teammate in this race. We're Team Superfly. But towards the end, uh, he doesn't look like a teammate at all, but you'll see that later. This is me chasing Bowie Boy. He's taken second from me uh, a lap earlier. Now I'm, I'm ready to take it back. After, Boom. After the accident earlier with you and him, you, yeah. you've now taken back into second. Right here, this is, I believe that's, uh, yeah, that's... That looks like Street Killer 3. Yeah, that's Street Killer. He goes over the berm, flirting with disqualification here. He doesn't go back and, and take the right path. He just goes on the wrong side of the wall. Um, you can see he's not trying to interfere. He, he actually lets Bowie Boy by before he gets back on his mongoose. However, And now that Monster is a massive see. collision. Yeah, Monster doesn't see him coming. That's a blind turn. Here's the replay. Boom. And Monster that is just some major air caught by that stuff. Yeah, yeah. Luckily, he lands on his wheels and drives away. Uh, if it he, if it hadn't, if Monster ha hadn't recovered is he so easily from that, uh, Street Killer probably would have been disqualified. We decided to uh, cut him some slack on that because we could see he was trying not to to uh, troll other drivers while he was going the wrong way. He just made a, a mental error and did the best he could. I have no idea how he managed to fly over the berm though and onto the other side of the track. It's not that steep a berm. You can uh, you can jump over it if, if you're trying. And now coming around the corner looks like Goldliner with a nice solid lead. Yeah, he's leading by a lot here. And he, he, here's where my race falls apart. I was in second place solid. Got into a weird nose wheelie. And instead of backing up, I just I figured I, I could whip it around real fast. But either way, I gave uh, KSI Milkman a chance to catch right up to me. And he takes full advantage of that right here. Pushing you over the berm and onto the other side of the track. Yeah, I didn't mind that. You know, I I made a bad call taking the outside on that turn. I sh I should have braked and uh, cut to the inside, but I was just too excited and upset with myself for getting stuck in that nose wheelie. And now, boy, now right here, boy, boys uh, now behind Street Killer, and I'm not sure who the other guy is. Mark uh, Mark Freeman Foreman. I'm not sure how to say his gamer tag. Uh, but yeah, uh, Bowie Boy is, is working on lapping these two uh, right here, and he's just, just looking for a chance to get by clean. It, it's always sketchy when you're about to lap someone because they got nothing to lose, and they might as well just just you know they're they're either thinking I'll troll this guy because I'm in last place and I got nothing to lose, or they're thinking I don't want to make enemies, so I should let this by guy. Let, let this guy by, yeah. <laughs> and that a nice makes sense. Turn back there, featuring one of the drivers spinning out sideways but maintaining his speed and continuing along. Oh, that's a massive crash from Bowie Boy. Yeah, I love that sequence. Bowie Boy just bides his time and waits for them to make a mistake and gets by clean. I always respect people that, that, that you know, make clean passes and don't troll. And now we're 
spectating some of the drivers here. And let's Dark Star doing some nice jumps and racing smoothly compared to what he was earlier. Yeah, I, I kill this track. I rarely lose on it when we're practicing. Um, there's only two or three people who give me a, a, a good uh, competition on this track. That'd be X Rains and ETS Monster. Uh, but Goldliner is really killing it. Like, he, he got out and, uh, uh, ahead of the pack early and managed to just stay out of trouble for the whole race and built a huge lead. Goldliner has a really awesome lead, though. Yeah. KSI Milkman here. This is his first ORL race. He uh, he raced in uh, last week. Um, so this is his first actual race, and he does quite well. Um, he's definitely an experienced driver, experienced forger. Uh, he's definitely one to watch in the future. He's proven his racing skills here, though, as he's doing really yeah. nice. Yes, definitely. Now, now, now here you can kind of see the difference between the experienced drivers and the less experienced drivers. The less experienced drivers top out on that straightaway around 85 kph. Now up here you, you watch Bowie Boy and he, I believe he just barely taps 90 before he goes into that bank turn. Um, but Bowie Boy is definitely more experienced uh, on this track. He's really starting to shred up that burn. Yeah. If, if you hit that berm right you can really keep a ton of speed on it. It's, it's one of my favorite berms on any racetrack. And now we here's have Monster. He's, he's raced his way into third place, I believe, at this point. He's a little ways behind me. And a really nice overview showing how far away the, all the track is split up. Where all the competitors are located, it's a really intense race. But really, yeah. it's very definitive as to who's going to win if no one actually ends up screwing up a troll. Yeah, it's, it's pretty clear, you know, Gold, uh, Goldliner has such a great lead at this point. He's going to have to, he's going to fall, hey, he's going to have to fall off the track two or three times before uh, someone uh, catches up to him. And right now, I think it's KSI Milkman topping out the other end of the podium with Goldliner in first and Milkman in third, which I think it's Darkstar in second. Uh, I'm in third place right here. Uh, it's Goldliner in first, KSI Milkman in second, uh, then me, then ETS Monster and Bowie Boy. Now at this point in the race, the, all, the only drivers that close to each other are me, Monster, and Bowie Boy. Now, now right here, you can see uh, our, our whole team teamwork thing just falls apart, and boom, Monster trolls me out of third place and into fifth. Uh, we're going to have words about that later. So that here you go, here's you Goldliner fifth. on the final lap. No podium for you today, getting trolled by your own teammate. Yeah. And Goldline is just cruising is. whilst he is in first. Yeah, he, he killed this track today. He's managed to actually stay away from all possible crashes and bumps and bruises from the other competitors, yeah. and has had a very yeah. nice clean race. Indeed he has. You know, I, I didn't get much, uh, many shots of, of him lapping uh, the two guys that are off the lead lap here, but bam. And you can see right there, that was me and Bowie Boy right in front of him as he went across the uh, finish. I had no idea we were that close to getting lapped. But uh, thanks a lot for watching, guys. It's been a heck of a race. Uh, my man stylizing here, thanks to him. Uh, definitely check out his channel on YouTube. It's Forge Playlist, and we'll see you next week. See you later, guys.